Hi, my name is Saurabh and I have a small time YouTube channel by the name Let's Learn Flight Simulator Together. Well, this video is not about flight simulators. Around a couple of months back, when I was starting this channel, I was looking for microphones that are available at a price range of close to $100. When I was doing my Google search, I found out that there are two microphones essentially that are available within that price range that are really good. One of them was Yeti Blue and the other one was HyperX Quadcast. This HyperX Quadcast was getting the work done for me, but then I realized it is causing popping noises in my video. To solve these popping noises, I got this pop filter, but even it didn't seem to solve the problem for me. So I started looking for another microphone and this time I wanted to get a better microphone so that I don't have to keep on buying more microphones again and again. After doing a lot of research, I found out that the Shure MV7 podcast microphone right here is one of the better ones that is available in the market right now. I will show a quick unboxing video of Shure MV7. It will be followed by a one-on-one -on -one audio comparison. First, I'm going to set the gain or the audio levels on these microphones to the optimum level. Then I'm going to use Audacity to record my voice on these microphones at the same time. I will play them one after another. First, I will speak 5 random sentences, then I will do a tongue twister. Then I will provide my honest verdict. One of them is clearly better than another. Let's hear them out. How is the weather like in the place you live in? How is the weather like in the place you live in? It is such a wonderful day outside. Let's go for a bike ride. It is such a wonderful day outside. Let's go for a bike ride. Have you heard they are getting new swans for our pond? Have you heard they are getting new swans for our pond? I'm looking forward to going to skiing for this winter. I'm looking forward to going to skiing for this winter. One of these microphones is better than another. Which one? One of these microphones is better than another. Which one? Betty bought a bit of butter, but the butter was bitter, so she bought a bit of better butter to make the bitter butter better. Betty bought a bit of butter, but the butter was bitter, so she bought a bit of better butter to make the bitter butter better. Time for my verdict. You may not like my answer, but the clear winner here is HyperX Quadcast. Now, before you hate me, please hear me out. Sure, MV7 is great. You get an app that lets you play with the depth of your voice. I have seen big shot YouTubers using it, so it has to be awesome, and I am in no way denying that. The reason I'm liking HyperX Quadcast is that being a person having an accent, having sound clarity is of utmost importance to me. Sure, MV7 provides a depth to my voice and people may take me more seriously with the added heaviness to my voice. But even if I select the lightest tone in Sure Motiv app, I find my voice easier to be understood through HyperX Quadcast as compared to Sure MV7. If you have a very clear voice and are very confident of your accent for your target audience, you may like Sure MV7 more. But if your voice clarity is of more importance to you, listen to the voice comparison part again and decide for yourself. And no, none of these mic makers have sponsored this video or have loaned me one to record. I paid $90 for the HyperX Quadcast and I paid $250 for Shure NV7 plus tax. The other reason I think HyperX Quadcast is better is because you can get it for one third of the price of Shure MV7. I will end my video here. I have not talked about their specifications as I am sure most of you have already researched about them if you are watching my video. Please like this video if you found it useful. If you are into flight simulators, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching.